Welcome to my channel. Today we will be doing a review for Cell and Temple, Season 1, Episode 4, When Agents Collide. Everything in this video is alleged entertainment purposes, in my opinions. So it starts with Tanel and Alexis. Be sure to hit that like button. I'm sorry. It starts with Tanel and Alexis, and um, they're waiting on a high profile investor, Ben. He is a buyer for the property. Uh, she tell Alexis, don't let me down. And Ben's arrived. He arrives in his red Lamborghini. That, when I, hmm, red is my favorite color. When I tell you that thing was life. But anyway, Ben um, pulls up in his fast car. And then Alexis, is that him? She's kind of dingy, you guys. You got to look over her. So he greets the ladies and they go in the home and they show in the home and everything. Rena's looking at a space to open her broker business. Anne arrives to see it. It's a nice office space. Very elegant. Anne says with Rena and the real estate law and she and real estate accountant, it just may work for those two. Rena says she's, she loves to be lawyer, but she's lawyer to her husband. She feels she doesn't have to be loyal to Sherelle. Rena feels that she has been burned by Sherelle. Rena and Colony Tanel and Alexis, they're sitting in the office and they're having real estate talk. And um, Sherelle is talking with um, Joanna because they arrived. They're coming through the doors. They're arriving to her realty company. And Sherelle and Colony just happen to have on the same outfit. Yes. And they going by who wore it the best, you know, and they are. Um, so they having a meeting and Sherelle says she's proud of Anne. But Anne doesn't believe Sherelle at all because of their previous meeting. So um, Anne just is not taking um, Sherelle serious at all because she feels like, OK, Sherelle, you already did something. Let's just let it go in one ear out the other. So, um, Joanna and Calney both, they're sitting at, you know, they're talking and everything. And Sherelle, she goes around asking each lady about their deals. And they all discuss their deals and what they have going on with their deals. And Sherelle actually seemed to be in better spirits at this time. Then we go to Joanna and Colony. They're, uh, they're, you know, they're showing condos and they both have condos in the same building. Um, Sherelle, um, they was discussing that Colony and Joanna, they're discussing they have clients in the same building. They sh you know, they're showing condos in the same building. But anyway, Sherelle tell the ladies they're going to Miami and they have two days to find a home in Miami. So the ladies, Sherelle and Joanna, they both go shopping for their trip to Miami. Sherelle says she set Joanna up on a blind date. And when, you know, when they get to Miami, uh, you know, Joanna kind of feel a little funny about it because she was like, is it too soon to go on a date? You know, because she's just now filing her divorce. While shopping, the ladies also bash the other ladies. So Tanelle wasn't able to make it to her meeting. So she sent Alexis. Alexis is a big failure when it comes to this property, y'all. She does not need to show homes ever again. Alexis, does, Alexis didn't know anything about the property. She didn't know how many bedrooms, how many bathrooms. Alexis, please pick a new career. Very pretty girl, but knows nothing about real estate. She didn't even know the uh, property taxes. So Joanna and Colony both are showing their condos in the building. and uh, But they're on different floors. And they're very nice and very upscale and modern. Colony has a handsome male client. But her saying something about going to dinner with her client didn't rub me right. I just, that didn't sit right with me, you guys. Uh, it didn't make sense to me. So Joanna's client mentioned her ex-husband, husband Brian. She said this is why she hasn't 
told anyone about them getting a divorce. It just makes her so uncomfortable. Her and Colney, you know, she Colney comes down to uh, Joanna's condo that she's showing. And uh, they sitting, they're talking about, you know, things. And she asks, um, Colney asks um, Joanna what, what all she does for Sherelle. And she said that Joanna is seeing, you know, they see her as HR. And Joanna said she likes to keep business separate from friends. Colney knew Sherelle before Joanna, so she can't understand how Joanna is so close to Sherelle. Tanel tells Joanna, this is, um, they all get together. Tanel tells Joanna and Sherelle, because they in the office talking at Allure Realty. Tanel tells Joanna and Sherelle about Alexis. How terrible Alexis effed up the, you know, the house viewing. And how she did so horrible showing the house to Ben. And Ben was so disappointed in Alexis. Alexis didn't know the basic things about the home. She was bland. Tanel is so pissed with Alexis. And I would be too because she could have lost the deal. But Ben said he understand it wasn't Tanel's fault. So Tanel had to go and show him the home again. Because Alexis messed up so bad. She was so poorly prepared. For her showing. Sherelle is disappointed in Alexis. Tanel says to fire Alexis. Y'all. Just get ready for episode 5. Because episode 5 is going to be that fire. Thank you for watching. Please hit the like button. And Please subscribe. subscribe. I Share need my you video. guys to subscribe. Tell others I about need my channel as well. In the description below, you will see some of the other things that I have going on. For my lipstick, the Red Lipstick Hustler, it comes in nine different shades. It's organic. Queen Lily Hair Growth Oil. If you're looking to grow your hair, this is the oil for you. It is organic as well. Also, on my website, my Red Lipstick Hustler page, I have earrings as well. Thank you for watching. I am also an author. I have written four books. You can find my books on Amazon.com and you can also find them on my website. I am Lily Young and thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for supporting me. Have a Merry Christmas. And if you would like to donate to my channel, the, the information for my cash app will be in the description and you can see it on the end of this video. Thank you guys. Merry Christmas and God bless. Bye.